Camp T, you guys got any questions? <laughs> good day today. So we're, we're excited to go to Camp T. Had a good solid scrimmage. Uh, had some weather blowing in and uh, Coach Casty kind of blew it, so we had to quit uh, the ones there. Uh, yeah, uh, can I retract that, Mark? Coach Casty kind of uh, was a little overcautious. That's good. So we our ones didn't get very many reps today. I think they had about 20 plays. Man, real explosive. Probably the fa one of the fastest uh, offenses I've seen. Really, really, really fast. We made, we made, we blow a coverage touchdown. Blow another touchdown. You make a mistake, it's a touchdown. And uh, Mike, I tell you, Mike's really, Burke's really been at a different level each day, and so he just gets the ball out so quick that uh, we really got some, some nice. Uh, weapons to use so really impressed there uh, real impressed with the, you know, how our guys responded defensively they came back uh, love the leadership and how they went about that so we're ready to go to camp t camp t is all about galvanizing our program developing that brotherhood that it takes to be successful and honoring the past uh, uh, by the time we spend there so looking forward to getting away for about five days Questions. How big a part is you're talking about the team speed? How big a part uh, has Gump played into that? He's pretty fast. Hey, DJ's faster. You put those guys at the slot. That's a lot of speed. But Devin's extremely fast. Uh, Tim White's extremely fast. Kalen uh, Velage is extremely fast. Demario is at a different level from his speed and explosive power. I mean, he's powerful. Uh, you know, we 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 got, we got a lot of diversity in our blocking. Like you know, Nick Ralston is a, I mean, just a bulldozer. I mean, he is a really uh, kind of a what's a guy that played for Tampa Bay? All stats. It's kind of who he reminds me of. It's that that kind of fullback. And don't underestimate his hands. And the other thing, I think we've really improved from that standpoint. So you're looking at a whole bunch of guys there. Now the key is. If you ask me what is the major concern offensively, too many penalties. Most of the guys committing penalties are guys that just got here. So we got to get that stuff cleaned up. We'll do that. So uh, um, you know, that's, uh, that's what my, from the standpoint of speed. And then the secondary, I mean, we're, we're fast on defense too. That's why we're trying to stay with the four linebackers set. We like the speed. What does Camp T do for the kids for the time that they're up there? Well, I tell you, in the modern world, you know, that we live in, you know, there's no headsets, there's no uh, iPods, iPads, uh, there's no cell phones, no TV. It's just uh, spending time together as a team, getting to know each other. Uh, the quarters are kind of cramp. Uh, there's, uh, the, the, the guys can barely fit in the showers. I'm saying, because we've grown a little bit over the years. <laughs> uh, just, just, it's just different out there. It's just something about it. Uh, we don't do that anymore. Even you think about that. How many, how much time do you spend without all that stuff? And, uh, and it's just a, a place where our team goes to come together. And it just, uh, it's about player to player accountability and leadership. The same thing with coaches. I mean, we spend a lot more time in these next, you know four nights and five days then we spend and have a little bit of time that we're not just constantly working so it's it's a special deal and it's one of the most incredible traditions uh there's my favorite thing is winning my favorite event is scrimmage camp t just that setting with all the thousands and thousands of fans that probably have to walk i don't know how many miles to get down in there in that little holler there uh, is, is really, really cool. I really like that. So it's a really neat experience. And uh, uh, it's the rite of passage to be a Sun Devil. And uh, I'd love to see us invest and make it a little bit nicer. Uh, but uh, especially for our players, just, just the accommodations and stuff like that. So hopefully we'll do that. But uh, no matter what, I think it's a necessity to be a Sun Devil because, you know, it's, it's paying homage to the past. But it's also vital in today's world uh, just to get kids to all focus on one mission. Uh, Camp T. Today's the first day you saw J.J. Wilson at Devil Backer. I know it's early, but how did it look? 
Well, I don't know. He went through individual. We'll look at the film a little bit. I, I think he's got an opportunity to really help us. I sure hope he just knocks it out of the park because he can give us a guy that can, can really do what Carl did and can put his hand down and stand up. And uh, so um, well, I'm anxious to see that. We also, he's coming off an injury, so we're being very careful. So we'll see him go through some individual, and, uh, maybe at Camp T. I don't know if he'll do much scrimmage stuff. But then uh, hopefully by the next Monday, he can be able to go full speed. So uh, JoJo Wicker was a real big standout today, and really pleased with how those young guys are going. Thanks, Coach. Uh,